who else feels the Christmas spirit barely in October? Honestly, me. We got the plaid pole going on in there. We got the white fuzzy sweater. So what is up, guys? Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we are going to be going to Ulta. Why, you may ask? To check out a whole bunch of their newly released holiday makeup items. I already went basically, but let me tell you, my heart sank so deep. Like, so beyond deep. I was literally in Candyland, but for makeup. They released so many amazing makeup kits for such amazing prices. It kind of blew me away. Um, I did not purchase anything because I do plan on placing an order on Ulta sites. And then hopefully I will be doing a haul in the next few weeks or so. Let me tell you go get some ice cream because you will definitely need it your eyes are going to be like popping i do love making these videos i would say about once a month i'll leave my previous ulta like shop with me video down below in the description box but yes i think that's pretty much it also if you're interested in how i got this look i posted this look up yesterday so i will also have that linked down below but other than that i hope you guys enjoyed this video let's go ahead and get started with um the holiday goodness How cute is this display right here from IT Cosmetics? This is the new Lash Blowout Mascara. I love that it looks like a hair product, but it's not. It looks like a curling iron, right? So here's what the texture looks like. It's a natural bristled wand, and it's retailing for 25 bucks. I usually have pretty good luck with the IT Cosmetics mascara, so I think this should be really pretty on. Okay, next up we have a nice amount of the Too Faced holiday goodies chilling right over here. So there aren't testers for everything, but I'll definitely swatch whatever I'm able to. This is one that I purchased from Sephora. I'm not sure if the video is up before this one or after, but it smells like a buttered rum. That's what it says. It's the Hot Buttered Rum Palette from Too Faced. Retailing for 25 bucks. I probably sound so annoying already because I constantly mention this, but I'm telling you, it's just a delicious baby. Then I see that they have these really cutesy Damn Girl mascaras um, in like an ornament type of form. It's crazy to be talking about Christmas now because it's barely October, but this mini size is retailing for 13 bucks. I have yet to try this. I don't know what the quality is like. And then I see that they have this Too Faced Christmas Star palette collection. So this one right here is exclusive to Ulta. They have one that's exclusive to Sephora. <laughs> the testers up there we'll get to in a second. This whole set is retailing for 44 bucks. And then briefly you guys can see what's included. So we get like one, two, three, four, five little palettes in a triangular shape. Uh, we get the Rich and Dazzling Lip Gloss in an exclusive shade, Ginger Snap. And then the Better Than Sex Mascara. Here's what it looks like in all its glory. We have the two little baby products that are included. And then here is what the palette looks like. It's so cute. It has like the same smushy feel as the one that was exclusive to Sephora. So for example, just pull that open. So it's all in one situation. It might be a bit bulky to take with you traveling, but if you're gonna just be using it exclusively like at home, it's pretty cool. I love like the shapes. It's kind of messy, but like different. So as you guys can see all around the palette, we have different face powders. So we have some highlighters, blushes. So basically two highlighters, two blushes, and one bronzer. And then here you guys can see what they look like swatch. These were with one swipe swatches each. Pretty. Not, no kick up really and pretty pigmented. Okay, so here are what the shades look like. I did go ahead and swatch all 20 eyeshadows. These were with one swipe swatches each, so pretty pigmented, kind of impressed. Um, there were probably like one or two that were a bit weak, but to the most part, they're, they seem pretty consistent. I would say the formula is thinner than the one that was released um, exclusively for Sephora. And then we have these two products that are included in the kit as well. The gloss seems like it's almost full size, and then we get a deluxe that's a bit better than Sex Mascara. Here you guys can see here on my arm what the gloss looks like. That was with two swipe swatches. It's a beautiful pinky purpley shade with a ton of glitters, but it's not gritty. It feels very smooth. And moving on to this little section here, I see that they released this adorable Christmas Party Essentials um, Duo. This is retailing for 26 bucks, but it's a $46, $47 value kit. You get a full size of the Better Than Sex Mascara, then a full size of the Twinkle Twinkle Liquid Eyeshadow in the shade Honey Believe. Uh, there are no testers, so I can't swatch it, but this looks like a gorgeous champagne. It's like similar to the Stila Glitter and Glows. And then we have this kit that includes three little palettes from Too Faced, the Christmas Party Eyes Merry and Bright set. I think that's what it's called. It is retailing for 35 bucks for three of these eyeshadow palettes, which I think is crazily affordable. Something great to probably gift to a friend or someone who's just starting out with makeup. Here's what the packaging looks like. Adorable. Or of course, you can like, keep it for yourself. I love how each palette has its own scent. Let's get started. Okay, so this is the first palette that's included in the kit. It says it smells like berry pie. 
And then I love how on the back it says to and from, which they do a lot with their holiday kits in case you want to gift it to a friend or a family member or someone. Here are what the shades look like. There are three like metallic -y finishes, one matte, and then a matte blush. Here are what the shades look like swatched. I think that they swatched nicely, but they're not like George droppingly like bombs away so just have that in mind maybe it would be great for someone who's a beginner next little one we have here is this one which is the smells like banana bread palette this one right here is probably the one that's the most neutral it does pretty much smell like banana bread i have to I have to give it to it um this one includes three mattes one metallic and then a cinnamony like blush but i guess you can also use it as a bronzer depending on your skin tone here is what the Smells Like Banana Bread palette swatches like. This one was a bit stronger than the previous one. Um, these are with one swipe swatches each. And I do like the color story a bit more because I feel like it would be perfect for like every day. And then we have this one right here which is the Smells Like a Sugar Cookie palette. And then here's what this palette looks like. I feel like it kind of combines like berry tones and then neutral tones as well. This one has two mattes, two metallics, and then a very berry blusher. Here is what the Smells Like Sugar Cookie palette swatches like. I would say it smells like raspberry tea. It smells so damn good. Um, this one I would say is in between amazing and like not the best. Um, this one I would say swatched okayly. Some of the shades swatched super smoothly and then the second one from the top was just very thin in consistency. It doesn't have a ton of pigment in there so... Just based on swatching these for the first time, I will say that it's not the best of Too Faced. So I don't know if I would 100% recommend it. But again, if you're gifting it to someone, if to someone who's just starting out with makeup, who loves Too Faced, who collects these things, it's adorable. Like, I mean, there really is no words. Okay, next section that we have up is the Catch the Gingerbread Man While You Can section. So cute. Stop. I'm going to say cute a billion times in this video. I know it's going to probably be annoying as shit. But anyways, um, we have this Gingerbread Kissable Body Shimmer. This is the size of my head this thing is huge 32 bucks we get the gingerbread extra spicy eyeshadow palette which i've done a review and swatch video on already i'll leave the link down below retailing 49 bucks and then we get the gingerbread girl liquid lipstick chilling over there which is just a re-release from last year okay let's talk about this for a second like i mentioned it's massive the cutest packaging alive it comes with like a puff <laughs> i feel like madonna it's so cool Ooh, and look there's a ton of like glitters in there I literally just slapped a blob on my hand, but this is so pretty. It's so, so thin. So if you want to maybe just like throw that on your shoulders or on your collarbones, this could look really pretty. It has so much sparkle to it and it smells like cookies. Then we have the extra spicy palette here by Too Faced. This one right here is the tester. So let's see what this is about. Here is what the shades look like. Like I mentioned, I did a review and swatch video on this. I'm not going to go ahead and swatch it in case you guys watch that. And it's kind of like, okay, we get it. But this is really pretty. I have to say, I think the quality is nicer than the one they released last year. But, I mean, both are still really good. This one right here just has more of a warmer vibe to it compared to the one they released last year, which I feel like is a little bit more neutral. And then, of course, the Too Faced Gingerbread Girl Liquid Lipstick is such a complimentary shade to the Gingerbread um, Man Liquid Lipstick they released two years back. They should have that on Sephora, though. Um, anyways, this is a beautiful terracotta. Every time I wear this, you guys compliment me to no end. So I think it's very, very universally flattering. We also have this kit right here that says Berry Christmas to You. And I just love it. It includes a nice amount of pieces for, what, 32 bucks, which is not bad at all. So I don't know where the makeup bag is, but there's a bag that's included in here. It says, you're like very pretty. I love that. You're like really pretty. Um, so there's that. Then we get a deluxe fruit cocktail blush duo in strobe berry. This is like yum. I'm not even gonna say baby anymore, but this is just like a newborn, okay? It's so cute. I actually do not own any of these, but it seems very smooth. It seems consistent. This one right here has a little bit more of a chalkier feel, but this one right here is very, very smooth. You can use one as a highlighter, one as a blush, mix them both together, use them as a blush topper. Okay, and then we get two full-size products in this kit. So I think for 32 bucks, it's well worth the price. Full-size of the Better Than Sex Mascara and a full-size of the Juicy Fruits Candy Finish Lip Gloss in Yummy Rummy. I don't... Oh yeah, I think I own one of these that I found at uh, Nordstrom Rack, but it's like a blue shade. When do I wear that? Um, once in 95 years. So this is definitely one that would probably be, you know, wearable for a day-to-day -day basis. That was with one swipe, so it's a true... Um, brownie bronzy 
metallic type of gloss. Next up, we have this little section here that includes a nice amount of Bare Minerals and Becca. It says, give clean beauty. Love that. And here you guys can see how everything is displayed. So pretty. I'm getting so excited. Okay, so there aren't any testers here to swatch. I believe because these products are part of their regular line, they're just um, packaged in a limited edition packaging and they're exclusive for the holidays, basically. So this is the Bare Minerals Mineral Veil Finishing Powder. It is huge. It says it's retailing for 41 bucks, but it's a $64 valued like powder, and it says a deluxe size collector's edition. The packaging is so cute. I love like the purpley color. We have this mascara kit here. It's the Limit Limitless Lashes Duo, retailing for 20 bucks for two full size mascaras. Pretty good. Then we have this kit right here, which is retailing for 25 bucks. It includes three full size products, and then here are the products that are included: the Gen Nude Metallic Liquid Eyeshadow in Golden Topaz, the Lash Topia Mega Volume Mineral Base Mascara, and then the One Fine Lash micro liner in exact onyx which I believe is a black and then we have this good to gloss kit from bare minerals as well as the full-size moxie plumping lip gloss trio 25 bucks it's so affordable so gorgeous and sparkly I wish they had testers damn the three shades that are included are in 24 car which is a glistening gold we have one in warm hearted which is a shimmering apricot which is a limited edition for this kit apparently then we have in brave soul which is a sparkling plum also limited edition for this kit how cute are these little ones i spoke about this in my ulta like holiday wish list type of video that i made last week it's the party popper ultimate lipstick love mini kit so i believe these shades are part of the regular line i think the lady mentioned that these are just little baby sizes packaging is adorable retailing for 25 bucks come on just yum he's so cute he's so cute okay and then we have this becca kit right over here which includes three deluxe size of becca's cult classic favorites retailing for 30 bucks but it's a 57 dollar 57 dollar valued kit i really like the packaging it's kind of like glittery perfect to give as a gift we get the backlight priming filter in this kit a lipstick in orchid the same formula as the lipsticks that are in this kit and then a um shimmering skin perfector and champagne pop then we have these larger kits chilling down here so this one right here is retailing for 29 bucks there are six deluxe size lip products so we have some of the matte liquid lipsticks from bare minerals which are bomb i speak about it all the time and then we have some of their glosses here are the shade names um, we get the shade in pout which is a patent lip lacquer in darling which is a patent lip lacquer as well the gen nude patent lip lacquer in sweetheart the matte liquid lip color in Juju, is that how you say? Juju. <laughs> um, and then the matte liquid lipstick in Boss. And then in So Fine is a matte liquid lip color. Okay, and then they have this glam packed kit, which is retailing for 46 bucks, but it's a $118 valued kit. We get what? One, two, three, four products that are included in here. The eyeshadow palette looks beautiful. So we get an Oasis Gen Nude palette, which includes eyeshadows and blushes, the Lashtopia Mega Volume Mascara, the Mineral Veil Finishing Powder, and then the Skin Longevity Vital Powder Infusion Deluxe Sample for smoother, stronger, meridian-looking skin. I hear you. Okay, fine. <laughs> I'm at the Tarte display now. I also spoke about most of these products in my Ulta video, but we're gonna run through them because now we see them in person and it's definitely more helpful than just seeing a picture. I think this is pretty neat. First of all, I love that they changed up the lid of the Shape Tape Concealer for this holiday kit. Um, it, this is retailing for 27 bucks, so you get the full-size um, Shape Tape Concealer as well as the deluxe size of the what is that called? Lights, Camera Lashes Mascara, which I think is pretty good. If this is your ride or die, which I feel like it's a lot of people's, then the concealer on its own is usually 27 so you're kind of getting that for free, and then the cutesy lid. Yes, I am so excited about this. I spoke to you guys about this in my Ulta video, right? Remember, remember! They don't have any displayed. I want to smell it, okay? Um, so these are retail. This whole kit is retailing for 18 bucks. This is the Cake Butter Body Butter by Sugar Rush, which is the sister brand to Tarte. I definitely want to test this out. It looks amazing. The three scents we get are sugar cookie, apple pie, and peppermint. A few of you guys mentioned that you've tried this, and you're like, yo, don't, don't play games. Don't, don't sit on this one. I'm like, whoa, okay, I got you, I got you. So I had to mention that. It's so nice to see this in person. How are you? Okay, then we get this little kit here from the Sugar Rush uh, line as well. I love it because you can test out a few of their pieces if you didn't really want to spend the full price tag on any of these items and then see if you like it or not, you know? This whole bundle is retailing for 20 bucks. There are no testers. We basically get a Sugar Rush gloss, a 
blush and then a light camera lashes mascara all I believe the luxe sizes well maybe the blush is a full size so the lip product is a lip oil which I've tried from the brand it's so yummy on the lips and it's in watermelon this blush is a cream blush in Baywatch I love this it's so cute it's like perfect okay and then we have even more goodies here from Tarte let's run through so firstly i see that they have this set of lip glosses and it's retailing for 29 bucks it's the busy gal gloss set you get a variety of different colors from like neutrals to like deeper shades i don't think these are going to be crazy pigmented but i love that they're small sizes you know guys know this already there's so much in each so like i feel like it would last forever you can keep these uh, all for yourself of course or gift them to friends it's just very very thoughtful what I like it so much. The this? Product, uh -huh. I know. Because it's so cute. <laughs> okay, then I thought that this was pretty genius. This is a kit of Tarte mascaras. I think that they're, they're three best selling mascaras. This whole kit is 35 bucks. This is a $69 valued kit. That's, that's crazy. That's crazy. I like this mascara. This I like as well. This I think is okay. Even if you'll use two out of the three, I think it's pretty good because you can always gift. You feel me? Okay, I'm gonna stop saying that. Um, we get the Big Ego mascara, which is the pink one, the Lights Camera Lashes, which is the middle one, and then the Man Eater mascara, which is this one. Next up, we have this Tarte Chrome Shadows kit. It includes four deluxe size um, chrome shadows. Interesting, interesting. Never tried these. Pretty neat. On the back, it says to and from. Again, great for gifting. We get the shade Wild at Heart. Rose, I don't know, don't scream at me. Um, pink diamond and citrine. So they basically look like loose eyeshadows. But there's a stopper in there as well, so it's not gonna be like messy. These are perfect sizes. <laughs> Next up, I see this um, double ended liners kit from Tarte here. Three full size eyeliners. Remember, they're double ended. You get a felt tip on one, on one side and then a co liner on the other side. 20 bucks. We also get the liners in three different shades brown, black, and burgundy. I like that they didn't just include three blacks or three browns, it's just a little bit of everything. And then we finally find the Stack Life. I spoke about this in my Ulta video as well. These are huge in person. I wish they had a tester. Damn, I want to see what this looks like, okay? $35, we get the gold, rose gold, and then the gunmetal stack. This is the best I could do, guys. I know it's kind of annoying for me as well. Basically, it says nine shades for 35 bucks, cheek stacks. And more kits here from Tarte. They don't have that like kit out on display, surprisingly. I thought that they would because I don't know, Too Faced has their kids out, you know? Alright, anyway, let's run. We have this lash curler for 20 bucks, like a bedazzled lash curler, and then a Big Eagle mascara, a deluxe size of that. Here we have the Tarte Remix Gloss Set. I love, love, love the pattern. I thought that these were deluxe sizes in my video, but they're actually full size. They're big daddies. Um, we get a whitish shade, bronzyish shades, and then like a pinky reddish type of color. So pretty. 28 bucks. Hello? Um, then we have this kit here. It's Tarte Holiday said that's exclusive to Ulta. They have one that's exclusive to Sephora as well. It's retailing for 49 bucks. You guys can see it comes with four different color like stories, like four little baby palettes. You can just grab and go or use it all in one. We get a Busy Gal Boss um, Gold Gloss. <laughs> Whoa, that was a tongue twister. And then a Man Eater Mascara. Yeah. yeah, it says four interchangeable palette and compacts. So you can kind of mix and match depending on what your preference is. I like that. I like that we have options. You know, they're giving us options. Then we have the Big Ego uh, Mascara here in like an ornament form. I like this. I don't love it. I don't know if it's worth 23 bucks. Just my opinion. Um, but yeah, it's cutesy. Benefit has my heart and soul like literally complete into one. More deliciousness going on over here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And then bending down, they get larger and larger. So cute. Each one is in a tin like box, and you can kind of reuse it. Oh my god. Okay, this one is so cute and like baby style. I don't know. Everything is baby these, these days. This is the Minis Van little kit. It's retailing for 20 bucks. Like I mentioned, it's in a tin little box. You can reuse this. I believe that this is removable. So yeah, reusable. Um, anyway, we get a three deluxe size products. The Benefit Bad Gal Bing mascara which i love the professional and then the gimme brow next up we have the i'm hotter outdoors kit retailing for 30 bucks and this little kit is orange one of my favorite colors alive wow pretty great value we get a full size of the hula bronzer a full size of the roller lash mascara and then a deluxe size of the gimme brow that's pretty good for 30 i'll take it and then bending down to this section we have the biggest of all the honk if you're hot 
kit. <laughs> Shit, I need this. I need the honk of your honk. Woo, that's us right here. So here are the four products that are included in here. They are all full sizes. We get a full size, their real mascara, a high beam, which I believe they changed the packaging for because it used to be a bit thicker and rounder. Well, not rounder, I guess it's the same roundness, but like thicker and shorter. Now it's like thinner and taller. <laughs> okay, <laughs> learn English. Um, and then we have a the gimme brow and then the pore professional these products are amazing just when i thought we're done with the trailers we have this one which is the biggest of all this is the queen of the camp trailer i love these names it's hitting home this is retailing for 50 bucks and we get four full-size products a full-size of the benefit hula bronzer bad gal bang mascara 24-hour brow setter which is great and then the pore professional so each set i believe is curated pretty pretty nicely with benefits like cult classic favorites and yes, then I see this. I didn't copy this sign, but it basically says benefit, big time, bestsellers, all boxed up and ready to glow. Yes. And when they have these two kits, I cannot find the price of this. I've been literally looking for the past like 10 minutes. I don't know. But we get um, two full size mascaras as well as a deluxe size mascara. So the Bad, Bad Gal Bang is full size, Roll Lash is full size, and their real is deluxe. I believe it's around the $30 price tag, which is pretty good just based on the price of this. And this is called the Prime to Glow Kit. We get a full size Their Real Mascara, I believe a full, full size Professional, and then a deluxe size of the Hula and deluxe of High Beam. So if it would be up to me, just personally, personal preference, I would get these like trailers. They're just like so like. Stop it. Alright, as I keep moving and setting up shop, I see more trailers just popping out of nowhere. But we can get down with this. This is a retailing for 44 bucks. It's the Travelin' Bright Kit. So something to keep in mind about this one, the box is not a tin box for this specific one only. The other ones, they're all in tin packages, but this one, it's a cardboard box. We get a full-size total moisture uh, moisturizer. I've tried that. Very, very nice. The Bravo Conditioning Primer, which I think is okay. It's a full-size, but pretty cool that it's included. The It's Potent Eye Cream. I think a deluxe size of that, and then a deluxe size of the Pore Professional. So a little bit of skincare and a little bit of makeup-y type of products. No, I love me some Urban Decay. I know it's a very cliche line to say. Uh, I just love them. They're just like everything to me. So first of all, this looks kind of cool. Um, they're they're going to be coming out with these body powders. A honey one, a heat one, and a cherry one. I'll take it. Coming soon. We will be waiting, okay? okay? Then they were supposed to have some of these lip plumper glosses here, but they're all pretty much gone. Uh, we only have the ones that are in the boxes, so I can't swatch or anything, but they're so beautiful. These are the only two that I see. I am missing cherry. So we get heat and then honey. Um, I like the matches. <laughs> Uh, these are retailing for 22 bucks each and then my babe in all of her glory chilling here at Ulta up front and center the Urban Decay Honey Palette I really really love this I have yet to do a look with this palette but it is top top notch next up we have this Tarte display this is the full feels little collection it says everything is $25 and under which I so appreciate I love that it's so cute, but it's affordable, and it's coming from Tarte, so we'll take it. First up, we have these glosses by Tarte. These are the Tartist Vegan Lip Gloss Trios. Uh, 25 bucks. They're all full sizes. I love the um, flat tops. Like, the lids are so cute. And um, we have them in apple, candy apple, cinnamon, and creme brulee. There aren't any out on display, so I can't smell them, but it sounds pretty good, just based off the name. Here's what it looks like packaged. Gorgeous. I'm, like, running out of words. Gorgeous, pretty, cute, babe. Adorable. <laughs> I also see that they repackage the Tarte Lights Camera Lashes in a plaid form so you can definitely pick that up if you're interested if you like this mascara I love like the plaid vibe give me all the full feels just like the name of the collection states and then we get this full feels eye and cheek palette 25 bucks again so affordable oh my god I literally thought that this was a palette and I'm like why does it look so smooth no the palette is not here so I cannot swatch it I don't know where it went but here is what it looks like packaged. It's nice, it's small, it's compact. You get a blush, some matte shades, some metallic shades. Very pretty. And this is not holiday, but I just wanted to share it with you guys. This is the ultimate brush of Set and Go Translucent Boost Powder by Urban Decay. There are five shades to choose from. What is the price? One second, 26 bucks. I love the packaging. 36 bucks, please. At 26, I was like, what? Okay, so the packaging is kind of cool. You guys can see this one is a tester. The brush is in there, you can just dust that on your face. It seems pretty neat based on other translucent powders that are on the market. So we have the shade Fair, Medium, Dark, Deep, and Universal, which I always go for either translucent or universal just because it'll suit any skin tone 
anytime, summer, winter, spring, fall. Next up, we have this kit here from Too Faced. This is exclusive to Ulta. It's retailing for $49. Firstly, it comes with the deluxe size of the Better Than Sex mascara, which just looks like candy. Did you guys watch that show from Friends where he's like, candy, no, you're not getting more candy. When Chandler was like saying it to the kid, it was so funny. Here's what it looks like packaged, beautiful. You can, and then these three pieces are like all separate, so you can kind of grab and go. Use them all at once, use them all separately, depending on your preference. And they are magnetic, so you can attach the head to the body. <laughs> Whoa, that sounds sick. Okay, here's the head. Anyway, this is this includes a highlighter and a bronzer. And the bronzer is the Chocolate Soleil bronzer. Kind of impressed that they put it in a holiday kit. And then the highlighter is in Angel Wings, which seemed a bit thick. Then we have the middle section of the body, which looks just like this. And then you open it up like that. So cute. This one basically includes the blushes of the family. The only one that was kind of pigmented was the one that's right under the bronzer, but the other one seemed a bit weak and very thin. So have that in mind. Maybe play around with it in store if you're contemplating on this. Okay, then we have the bottom part of the body, aka legs or butt. And here are what the shadows look like in here. And if I counted correctly, there are 19 shades that are included from various in various different finishes. Uh, my response would probably be like, oh yeah. Only because some of the shades swatch nicely, but it's kind of inconsistent just based on swatching it for the first time. Um, yeah, definitely play around with it in store if you were thinking about this one because this compared to the one at Sephora, like day and night, kinda. I like that there are so many finishes in here, like a lot. Like there's a loose glitter that you would probably have to use with a glue, right? There's metallics, uh, heavier metallics, lighter metallics, shimmers, mattes, um, what else? Uh, mattes that have glitter. It's just like a little bit of everything. The color story is unique, it's different. But yes, play around with it in store because I don't want to kick my ass if you're like, yeah, I got it, it's shit. It's like, okay. Also, the pan sizes of these um, eyeshadows are pretty tiny. I would say even smaller than the ColourPop 9 pan palettes shadows you feel me like a teeny bit smaller than that like i would say dime size no nickel nickel um between dime and nickel wasn't that crazy like wasn't that just insane i hope you guys enjoyed this video definitely 100 percent let me know what you think of all the products that released what stands out to you the most what do you think you're gonna pick up for yourself what do you think you're gonna pick up you know to give to a friend or a family member all of that i need to know i like to know this information <laughs> okay, anyways, I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>